Welcome to the conversation, everyone. I'm Nick Scarpino. This is Tim Geddes, and today we're talking Smash Bros. Now, yes. Tim, it is my understanding that we get a new Smash Brothers screen every night. Is yes, that correct? Every weeknight. So yes. tell me what's 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 big this week. So the biggest thing to happen this week is a huge focus on alternate costumes. Okay. Which is exciting. So here we see Little Mac's alternate costume. Right. We've seen it before. It's the wireframe Little Mac. That looks like it might get confusing. No. A little bit if you're playing against him. No. No. no it's, it's, it's the there's, some, there's some good lines there. Okay. We're, we're going to be good. Continue. It's from the original Punch-Out game. Gotcha. So, fun little fact here, the original art was actually done by Shigeru Miyamoto himself. Fantastic. Yeah, he's the one that drew the wireframe. I tried to get him to do my portrait once. It didn't did not go out? well. No, it didn't yeah. go well. well worked, not at all. It worked for Little Mac. Well. Now, what's great about this is alternate costumes hasn't, haven't really been a thing in Smash up till this point. We all wanted them. We kind of get them a little bit like Mario had the Fire fire Mario costume. Right. And um, the Wario. The Samus's count? Who? The Samus's count? No. Zero suit? That's a different character. That's a whole different character. Yeah, okay. we're, we're talking just alt costumes with different. The same move sets. Got it. Um, like, we haven't gotten something like Dr. Mario compared to Mario. Okay. You know, which would be awesome. Like, as the same character, same move sets. Right. Just, just different. Just looks. a different look. Gotcha. Um, except in Brawl, we had Wario, and um, he had an alternate costume of his original classic overalls, and okay. he also had the Wario wear outfits. But now it looks like they're doing a lot more because the other screenshot is the the villager from Animal Crossing. Right. We are getting the female or male villager. Now, Tim, which one are you gonna play as? The male looks cool. I like the male. The little I like classic the male. with the number. I, one. I, I'm, I'm a little partial to the female with pink hair. Personally. Pink hair? Yeah, it's very you know. Imagine imagine getting your ass kicked by that. Yeah, That's that'd fantastic. be that would be fun. That's but, pretty demoralizing. Cool you see four very different looking villagers for this rep, and that's awesome because. Think of the possibilities for someone like Mario mm -hmm. or for someone like Link. So you think this is going to be across the board? I'm, I'm hoping. That would like be the fact that we're seeing it with some of the newer characters really makes me think that they're going to go back and give us fierce deity Link from Majora's Mask. That would be awesome. Now here's what I really want to know. What's yeah. happened with my boy Charizard? So Charizard, here, we're getting some, some cool things. We've got two screens. One, something we already knew is Final Smash is Mega Charizard X. Car? In of course. Games. Yes. Naturally. Well, what is new here is they changed his right beat. In uh, Brawl, he had a Rock Smash, which was awesome. Right. They which now was, moved that to his Down B. Which you, you always got. You I do. Al you I always do that. It would be the most annoying the thing on, the, on the, the planet. So his Down B is now Rock Smash. Mm -hmm. His Right B is Flare Blitz, which for those that play Pokemon know, is a, it's a powerful fire attack that actually damages yourself too. It looks insane. When it hits. Yeah, so it looks like, you know, it's a big flame thing. So it'll be fun. Uh, but the recoil damage is going to be interesting. So that shows it's going to be, you only get it if you make contact. There's a couple moves in Smash that are like this, like Ike's B, Ike's, yeah, when he holds, that, you hold when he holds it too that, long, yeah. and Pichu back in Melee would always hurt himself. Um, but so this this is going to be interesting. Okay. Now what's happening uh, for those fans out there of table tennis? Table tennis. So <laughs> it's actually um, the TV <laughs> games in one. Color TV Game 15. It's an old Nintendo home entertainment system, but like before the NES. Right. And this is crazy. There was a there was one called the Six, but this is the 15. What the number tells you is how many different versions of table tennis you're getting. Okay. It's like a Pong-esque game. And here it's an assist trophy. We don't yeah. call it Pong though, we call it table we tennis because we don't want Nintendo to mm. sue us. Yeah. Or so, Atari to sue us. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. So you throw the assist trophy down and then it essentially makes the Pong, or the table tennis mm -hmm. things go on and the things will be back. Now no one's controlling these though, right? These are yep. just... Yeah, and it's, so they even said that there, there was pains, painstaking precision put into this to make sure that the, the lines are moving at the speed they originally moved at in the game. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. Science. Yeah. Exactly. Tim, what else? What else do we have here? There's one other thing left, yeah? Yes, there was one more. It is a trophy. Five days in the week, being five days in the week yes. and all. Trophy of Brittany from Pikmin 3. Oh, okay. Which essentially just confirms that she is not in the so battle. So she's not going to be a playable character. She's not going to be a playable character, just but we're getting the trophy. And Sakurai, the director of the game, once again shows that the model and expression is well designed. They're a big fan of the little details in these games. I mean, the little details tell it, yep. right? That's it's what makes us all. That's love what it. makes the whole Nintendo thing great, and that's what makes Smash Bros. awesome. And so. that's what makes it worth the wait. And Pretty speaking fun. of wait, we have got five more screens happening next week. Check back at IGN.com for all your Smash Brothers news.